Bünyesinde uzman doktorlarla hızlı ve güvenilir hizmet anlayışını kendine prensip edinmiş uzun yıllardır hizmet veren Doktors For You kliniği İngiltere sağlık sisteminde büyük bir boşluğu doldurarak toplumumuzun yanında olmaya devam ediyor. Ürolog Doktor Dimitar Ormanov prostat problemi yaşayan kişilere önemli tavsiyelerde bulundu. Hello, my name is Dr. Dimitar Ormanov. I'm urologist here at Doctors for You, the uh, private clinic. Uh, I'm a urologist with more than 20 years uh, experience in the field, and uh, a part of being urologist at Doctors for You, I'm also an NHS consultant. So uh, today I would like to speak about the uh, one of the most precious things for men, which is the prostate and this is because next month in november there is a new trend from few years now called november with m november which is a month for awareness for male disease such as prostate cancer testicular cancer and disease related to men's health so uh, first thing is i need to speak a bit more about the uh, prostate what is uh, prostate Prostate is an organ which every man has and it's in uh, close relation to the bladder. Uh, actually, it sits in front of the bladder and it uh, has a uh, vital role for uh, ejaculation and for sperm production. Long story short is that the prostate is uh, responsible for the liquid part of the uh, man's ejaculate. Uh, at some point, the prostate uh, with the age uh, starts uh, growing because the prostate's anatomy uh, the consists with uh, the prostate consists of uh, glands and uh, muscles. The muscle part of the prostate is responsible for uh, ejaculation is a part of the ejaculation process, and the uh, glands of the prostate start growing uh, with the age. This is where the uh, so-called prostate symptoms start. Uh, there is no uh, recipe or any formula about the uh, prostate uh, when the prostate uh, problems start and how long is it going to take or what symptoms every man is going to have. Um, it's different for uh, everyone. Some men are uh, worried to talk about uh, prostate, uh, about their uh, urinary problems and prostate problems. The prostate usually, uh, the first symptoms of the prostate is uh, weakening of the uh, flow as well as uh, night wake-ups or so-called nocturia, uh, where the patients start uh, being aware that there is something uh, different uh, going on at this stage. It is very important to, uh, uh, for the men to know that the prostate does not take any part of the erection. Prostate is not responsible for your erections. If you have problems with the erections and you feel this is because of the enlarged prostate, I want to make you aware that this is not true. Prostate does, is not responsible for the uh, erections. Uh, enlarged prostate is not a disease. This is also uh, another uh, message. You need to know that the enlarged prostate is just a condition. It's not a disease. What are the symptoms of uh, prostate enlargement uh, or so-called prostate symptoms? This is the weakening of the flow. This is the nocturia. Some men might wake up once, twice, three times. This is the feeling of not completely emptying the bladder. This is so-called dysuria. And uh, in some uh, cases where the prostate is really uh, very big and is uh, causing uh, storage struggles, is when the flow starts and stops and the end stage is uh, if the man leaves the uh, he, uh, ignores his symptoms for a long time they may fall into so-called urinary retention or inability to empty the bladder which is a condition usually treated uh, on first instance with uh, catheter and uh, then uh, with possibly with surgery so it's important to uh, 
how how do we diagnose the prostate problems prostate problems is first is conversation with the uh, patient examination which is uh, using an ultrasound scan to measure the size of the prostate as we need to uh, know what exactly we need to know about the size of the prostate and this is uh, uh, also in re uh, direct relation with uh, the uh, treatment uh, which uh, and helps us to choose the, the correct treatment. We also uh, check the, the size of the prostate uh, with, uh, we examine the prostate through the back passage and very important we uh, ask every patient having a uh, so-called low urinary tract symptoms or symptoms related to uh, the prostate is a uh, so-called PSA test which stands for prostate specific antigen. This is a test which gives us valuable information about uh, any uh, internal uh, problems and the elevation elevation of these tests uh, might be a sign for uh, uh, awareness and might prompt further investigations for prostate cancer. It is very important to know about the uh, prostate cancer because the prostate cancer does not have any specific symptoms. All the symptoms, uh, the prostate cancer, prostate cancer is a tissue diagnosis and is usually, is usually diagnosed uh, with a prostate biopsy and uh, MRI scan. This is uh, something which needs to be done in case the PSA levels are really elevated. So how we treat the uh, prostate symptoms? The prostate symptoms are usually uh, treated with uh, medication. We have a very effective medication uh, to relieve the symptoms, but it's really, really very important for uh, the man to know that there is no medication, in, uh, there is currently no uh, medication which can stop the growth of the prostate. There is a medication which relieves the symptoms uh, and can slow down the growth, but not to stop it completely. There are a lot of uh, tablets on the market which are sold for for prostate symptoms. Some of them are sold over the counter. Uh, some of them uh, are uh, prescribed by uh, doctors. The tablets which are uh, freely sold and you can buy uh, elsewhere are usually uh, on a uh, are usually herbal uh, medication. Some of them are with no proven effect and uh, taking of such tablets might not relieve the symptoms and might not help. Taking such tablets might not relieve the symptoms and might not help. I would recommend for everyone who has a prostate problems or problems uh, with a, uh, or urinary I would recommend every man having urinary symptoms to seek for specialized urology advice. This is always important and uh, does not need to be delayed. Many men delay their uh, visit to the urology office as they're usually uh, ashamed or they ignore their symptoms. Uh, it's always important to know that uh, having low urinary tract symptoms uh, need further investigation and need uh, and might prompt some and and might require some uh, further imaging and uh, blood tests and uh, early start of treatment. Mm -hmm.